What's up guys, this is P-Sensei. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to play Game Boy Advance games on your DS system from your flashcard. Now for this, you're gonna need a DS, any model will work, DS, DSi, 3DS. Of course, you're gonna need a flashcard, and as always, I'm using the R4 SDHC Dual Core. And on your flashcard, you're gonna need to have the firmware installed, and you're gonna need to have YS Menu installed. I have videos on both, I will leave them in the description. And of course, you're gonna need your micro SD card and a way to plug that into your computer. If you have everything already set up, you're ready to move on to the next step. All right, so simply take this micro SD card, put in your adapter and put it into your laptop or computer, and I'll show you what to do next from there. All right, after you put your micro SD card into your computer, what you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and do is go over to the link I provide in the description for the GitHub page for GBA Runner 2. Once you're here, Go ahead and click on the releases and go to the latest version, should be the one at the top. Click on assets and download the ARM7 DS version. All right, save that anywhere you want. I'm gonna save it to the desktop. Okay, after that, what you wanna do is go ahead and copy and paste the Google Drive link that I provide. This will link you to a BIOS.bin. This is the GBA BIOS that you need to run GB Runner 2. It will not run without this, so go ahead and download that save that to your desktop as well or whatever wherever you want all right after both are finished downloading um we need to go ahead and go to our flash cart so mine right here put it on the right side and as you can see we have gb runner and biostep in simply just drag and drop both of those to the root of your sd card all right after you do that time to add some games you can add them any, uh, anywhere you'd like, but I like putting them in the folder. I'm just going to call this GBA. All right, just get some games real quick. All right, make sure they are in a .GBA format and not compressed with anything. Okay, and that's all we need. We have our game, we have the BIOS, and we have GB Runner 2. So, after you've done all that, all you need to do is plug it back into your DS. So go ahead and eject your SD card, and I'll show you how to get it set up on your DS. Okay, after you've taken your micro SD card out of your computer, go ahead and put that back into your flash cart, and put this back into your DS and turn it on. All right, now we're here, go ahead and go to YS menu. And go to GBA Runner 2, press A. And here we are. Now, for me, fire, um, Pokemon Fire Red immediately shows up, but if your game is not in a GBA folder, um, it'll just show the folders and then from there you can just navigate to wherever your game is. Because I have a GBA folder, it automatically just went to it. Alright, so here's all the GBA games that, you're, that you have. Go ahead, go to any one you want, press start. Give it some time. Alright. Here we have the, G the GBA BIOS, and as you can see, our game's loading up. And as you can see, we have Pokemon Fire Red running from our R Forest. You can see there's nothing in the GBA slot. This is all running from our R4.